Nice of you to drop in. I'm offering you something only a handful of people have seen. An even smaller handful live to tell the tale. <laughs> I offer you a chance to take a glimpse into my mind. To see the world how I see it. Did I scare you off yet? No? Excellent! I knew you would understand. I mean, after all, you of all people should know. There's nothing so cruel as memory. The pointy, bitey little thunderbolts, unwanted party crashers, screamers through your synapses. <laughs> Inescapable, unrelenting, not at all friendly. You can't even escape into madness! And then you meet someone who changes your life, and you feel that you don't even know who you are anymore. Isn't it funny how one encounter can cleave off little pieces of your past, deform your memories and persona, until you rethink your whole identity? And as you realize how foolish it all is, your laughter reverberates off the walls of your own emptiness. <laughs> You want to know something funny? I used to think of fate as evil. Predetermined. Not by some higher power, but by the rules of human nature. But now I understand. There are no chance encounters. It was all meant to be. If everything was left to chance, the human race would have been destroyed long ago. Do you know how many times we've come close to World War Three over a flock of geese on a computer screen? Do you know what triggered the last World War? An argument of how many telegraph poles Germany owed its war debt creditors. Telegraph poles! <laughs> it's all a joke! Everything anybody ever valued or struggled for, it's all a monstrous, demented gag! So why can't you see the funny side? Why aren't you laughing? <laughs> <laughs>